Hi, hello, I am Kiran Kumar from Nature of Physics. Today's topic is Equilibrium of a Particle Student. For this, a bob of simple pendulum is held at rest by applying horizontal force EF student. See there, clear diagram is given. This is the rigid support student. S is the rigid support and there is a simple pendulum of length L m is the mass of the simple pendulum okay who is the mean position student this is mean position and this is taken as extreme position student extreme position okay and continuation there here the body get means the simple pendulum is moving from mean position to extreme position by horizontal force EF. See there, horizontal force. And at extreme position, it is making an angle theta. Okay. And at extreme position, it is in equilibrium position, student. What position? Equilibrium position. So that now tension always act toward the rigid support, student. Now tension T is also resolved into two component because of here this is two dimension so opposite angles are same now tension is written as this is t cos theta and this is t sin theta student this is t sin theta mutually perpendicular to each other because of this is two dimensionally tension is resolved into two components and always downward direction what is acting student mg is the weight of the body is acting see at extreme position p here t cos theta is balanced by the mg and t sin theta is balanced by the force f f is the horizontal force student so that i can write there first one t sin theta is balanced by the horizontal force is equation number one next t cos theta which is equal to mg both are equal in magnitude and opposite in direction from equation one and two represent one is horizontal direction and second one is vertical direction student okay from this equation we can write magnitude and direction step by step student okay so first i am going to write the magnitude student magnitude so for this two dimension vector taking 2d student so that the basic formula is using diagonal square is equal to side square plus side square okay so what is the diagonal is there student okay t square okay so t square which is equal to remaining sides are taken as what is that student one is mg and another one is taken as what is that student f otherwise simply we can write another equation like this first i am writing according to the formula so first one is mg second one is ef square student so that i can write here t which is equal to wait a minute t is equal to i can write root over tell me student mg square plus ef square and next equation one square plus equation one square plus equation two square writing student equation one square is what t square sine square theta plus t square cos square theta which is equal to so f square plus mg whole square see there student so equation one square lhs site that is t square sin square theta and rhs side is f square and second equation lhs side t square cos square theta and rhs side is mg whole square okay student so that here t square is common student that is sin square theta plus cos square theta which is equal to f square plus mg whole square student now t square the sin square theta plus cos square theta is 1 that is f square plus mg whole square student i got tension t is equal root over f square plus mg whole square okay now i can write this is equation number 3 
this is also equation number 3 but here directly basic formula using here equation 1 square plus equation 2 square according to the first equation and second equation both are same equations we got equation 3 written there and next one I am going to find the direction student okay direction for this using again equation 1 and 2 only student okay so equation 1 divided by equation 2 yes tell me student what is that equation 1 is t sin theta divided by equation 2 is t cos theta which is equal to rh side f divided by mg student so t t is get cancelled student sin theta by cos theta that give the tan theta student okay tan theta which is equal to f divided by mg now i can write this is equation number four student from the fourth equation we can also write theta which is equal to tan inverse of f divided by mg student okay now i can write this is equation number five okay student and using the equation four student okay that is from equation number four i can write force f which is equal to mg into tan theta student based on the given values we have to select the suitable formula and also comparison is there student i will do like this see here <coughs> this is the point is q representing student okay this is sq sq value which is root over l square minus x square using the basic formula diagonal square is equal side square plus side square student like this diagonal square is equal side square plus side square diagonal is representing is what student there so here diagonal is representing length length is remain same at mean position and also extreme position l square and next one of the side is this is okay p q represent x student so that is x square and another side is unknown side that we are going to find so tell me student l square minus x square is equal to s square where s is equal to homo student root over l square minus x square see written clearly here okay student at equilibrium okay so there x divided by f student x divided by f is equal to next l divided by tension student which is equal to root over l square minus x square is divided by mg student okay so we will get different equations also student from this like this we can use the formula we can determine the values also different different equations okay for example i can write x divided by f which is equal to root over l square minus x square divided by mg student we can find from this x is equal tell me student f into that is root over l square minus x square divided by mg okay and also we can balance there l divided by t which is equal to root over l square minus x square divided by mg and also we can write here like this student like this that is x divided by f which is equal to okay l divided by t student okay so different equations we can write this is clear information about the equilibrium position of the particle example taken as bob of simple pendulum is held at rest by applying a horizontal force is f student okay thank you Please like and subscribe and comment.